people today we are back with decades so we are about to roll for izumi she's aging up into a child finally because she is so freaking annoying let's see what she gets what was the numbers okay she was so close oh my god she was so close to dying but she doesn't die the women never die she will be proper that's a perfect trait okay here is izumi okay so we are over at the nishidake household to age up yoda so the numbers that she cannot roll are she's aging to a child so they're the same as izumi's were three nine and eighteen and she has a i believe it was a 15 percent chance of dying once again really close but she did not uh, die so let's go ahead and age her up okay she will be lactose intolerant let's go here is yura i really need to download more kimonos because i'm already tired of using the same kimono for every single child so that's something i'll probably do didn't want to play past saturday because today is the spring harvest fest and although i could have like recorded that i just figured i i was playing this morning so i just figured i might as well put this in the video but the main thing that we are trying to get to today is asano's birthday and i already kind of have her figured out what i want to do for her so let me put my my headphones in hope you guys like my outfit okay i was trying to go for some funeral chic um kind of themed with the last episode whenever a bunch of people died well only one person died but and somebody else died as you saw in the screenshots um you don't even know who that is <laughs> but let me explain okay so kado the guy that you saw in the screenshots that died he is was supposed to be mine's love interest but i he died they went to the theater and everything so that happened but he died so obviously mine isn't meant to love anyone obviously because they either cheat on her this is kind of it's kind of sad but they either cheat on her or they die so it's all the, the game's obviously sending me a message that it's just not meant to be and that's why i downloaded a bunch of cc i downloaded a lot of build cc because i want us to renovate our house but i didn't have a whole lot to like put with clutter and all of that so there's not a lot of cc for like there's modern cc for like japan but there's not medieval cc and like, it just sucks i had to scrounge the internet almost get viruses on my computer go to sketchy websites just to hunt down these the cc, this cc that i already have okay I was scared for my life. I just ordered over the ear headphones and I can't wait because these headphones are the, they're so freaking annoying. Like they always slip out your ears. I already, I already talked about this. I feel like I always repeat myself, but like, see, it slips out of my ears. How am I supposed to, oh my God. I remember one time I had to tape it to my ear in order for it to stay. Like, what poor design. Mini has to do everything. Honestly, she doesn't though. When I was playing off camera, literally Asuna was doing everything. She was doing everything. And Mini, I don't know if Mini's depressed or what's happening, but she wasn't doing anything. I had to force her to, to do something useful with her life. The only thing that she really does is do the laundry. She doesn't help out with the farm anymore. She said, Asuna, do that. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of, of this, this life we live. Let me paint in the back with a trash can. That's what she said. Poor Asuna just has to carry the load. And I think it's made Asuna bitter. I think it really has. But honestly, that's why she deserves... That's why she deserves to, to marry the samurai. Is because she's doing all the work. Izumi eats all the food. She... I'm just saying, like, that's why Asuna deserves. She's she's had a hard life. We're talking about trials and tribulations. She's had them. What's her last name, Delegato? What happened? 
What does she do? Can kids plant things? Because if not, what is the point of them? But we can gather around the campfire and sing our campfire song. Because it's campfire time. We can tell a group story. Um, a ghost story. Oh my god, these earphones can go to hell. They really can. They really can. I hate them so much. Sit down, Asuna. Sit down. I guess she's not gonna sit down. Asuna looks so bored. <laughs> there we go. A little bit of excitement. There's gotta be something else we can do. How about she apologize first for whatever she did? They haven't been getting along lately. Share spring harvest excitement. All the snow is about to melt away. I'm so excited for it to stop freezing. The thing is, I, I got CC for their winter wear. And now it's not even about to be winter. I got this little, like, scroll CC. So cute. I wish you could interact with it. That's something they should have added to Snowy Escape. That would be so cool. If you could, like, do calligraphy. That would be so cool. Um... But they didn't. Honestly, I wish Snowy Escape was a little bit more detailed. I don't typically complain about that pack because I didn't really mind it. But I do wish that it was a now doing this. I wish it was a little bit more detailed with how with their like Japanese objects. Because there's so many cool parts to Japanese culture that they could have explored a little bit more. Finally, we are in 1564. Nice. Can they clean the... They cannot... Children can't do anything. Like, when I was a child, I could clean the toilet. So why can't they? And what I want to do in this episode is find her a, uh, a person that she's... The person that she's going to be with. Because I think it would be really cute. I don't think that they would do this um, because they probably just got married off to whoever their, their mother chose or their family chose for them to be with based on social class, which we will be doing it for social class. But maybe Asuna just gets lucky because I want her to be with someone that she is like already knew it was like friends with or already had feelings for. I think that would be super cute to have like this love story for the next gen. So I want to pick out who that's going to be in this episode so that they'll already be ready and we can like place them in the world and the next time, you know, things will already be rolling. Keep getting notifications about the chickens wanting to leave. And I'm tired of it. If you're going to leave, just leave. If we told every single part of history is interesting. I thought when I took US history last year that um, when we got to like more modern history, it was going to be annoying or not annoying, but like boring, but it wasn't. It was actually the most interesting part of u.s history because it had the vietnam war uh, watergate and like the hysteria of like communism in america it was so it was honestly so fascinating i feel like every part of history has something interesting and unique about it it's just about with this challenge finding ways to bring that out with like the resources that you have i think that's why th this challenge is so cool is because you get to explore that time period and how people lived um in a different way because we we tend to see it pretty one-dimensionally through like paintings and all that but through this you get to see it you get to live it i honestly think it'll, i'll be so sad whenever we do get to modern history because i'll miss this i think this is very debatable but i think the fashion in like the 1700s like some of the fashion back in the day was so much more cool than fashion like when they wore um, the big dresses in france like that stuff is so beautiful they were extra for no reason and that's what i wish fashion did now some of it does but i don't know i just wish it's not as extra as it was back then what did i say she always takes stuff first but she wasn't born first so i'm confused i got this little pagoda i think that's what it's called is it pagoda pergola per 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 i don't know what it's called but 
I got this from Debug. Plop that baby on a platform. And this is where we... If we, like, ever go foraging or something, this is where we put our, like, crops. Or if we ever do, like, some flower arranging, we can put that in here. It's just, like, an extra recreational shed situation. And that's honestly all I did. Oh, I put the fence around that's also from debug and so is this like little opening i don't know what that would be called but um also that let me tell you about my plan for izumi so for izumi i want to i wrote it down everything so i don't forget so I, like i said in the last episode izumi is going to be with the portuguese man she's going to start her portuguese legacy so I was thinking, I was thinking that she would um, get pregnant prematurely to whenever she was planned to get, she was planned to get married off. And then they run away together. And I was thinking that they run away to the north. Um, and in my rules, I did say that the rich people live in the north, but I think I might change that. Um, because I was reading that they can't travel between like the north like wherever they live unless they're rich but i think i might just i think i'm gonna take that out of the rules because i think that might be cool to like have her go as far away as she can um so we're gonna travel with izumi over to their house no one's home no way let's go see there they are i knew they were lying to me let's just give her the milk and then we'll sell the rest. Want to be invited inside? Please? Not the umbrella. Okay, let's leave. What a pretty landscape. It's so gorgeous. Osno's birthday. She gets onion soup. How, how delicious. So while she's eating, we might as well go ahead and roll for her. She has a 10% chance. Once again, she's probably not going to die. Numbers that she can't roll are a 7 and 17. So the chances of her dying are very low. But you never know. I swear, if she dies, I'm gonna be so mad. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Come on. Oh, okay. She lives. Izumi can die. That's mean. Okay, but like, I wouldn't- What I'm trying to say is I wouldn't care if she died, but if Asuna dies, that would mess everything up. Okay. Materialistic. You know, that kind of makes sense with the storyline. Because maybe, maybe she does like the person she ends up with, but she also likes that he has money. Here's Asuna. Here's her makeover. I might find a alpha version of this hair. And baby went, what did I tell you? She was looking rough at first. She was looking rough. And then I put the juice on her. I put the pizzazz on her, the skin detail the cc in my girl is beautiful i knew she had it in her i knew she had the potential i just had to bring it out and we now need to go and make her mans which one of these is the cutest because my girl osno deserves the best he's all right which one looks the most samurai the the let me do most popular Ooh. Potential, potential. I think it's one of these top ones. He has potential too. So he already has a beard, but I eventually, I kind of like him better, honestly. Yeah, I was gonna see what they would, what he would look like with a beard, but nah. I think I'm gonna change his name to just make sure that it matches the times. And I think I've been picking from the side that's their family, not family names. So I'm gonna stop doing that. Ones are like the most. I guess I can show you. The ones I like the most are Motonori and Tomoji. I feel like Tomoji is the cutest. So, and we also need to pick a last name because this is the la the last name is changing. I forgot. Okay, I've been randomizing for a while, but I think I saw one that was Iwasaki, and that's the one I like the most. So I think that's the one we're gonna go with. So here he is, and. I will be off camera building up the relationship, of course, showing you guys with the highlights if they're they go on a date or anything. So I was inviting over to Moji to build their relationship and 
I let me show you. I go to the romance real quick. To the romance, I and I home. see, I believe this is the wonderful wind. whims <laughs> sign. I'm like, hold up. Doesn't that mean something? Uh, yeah. I go over here. Very, very attractive. Whoa, now is the time to move in for the kill. So that's Sorry. exactly what I'm gonna do. Flo We're gonna flirt with him a little bit. I hate the ask of single because it's kind of pointless. I already know that he is. Um, tickle mercifully. How does he feel about us, though? Do we know that? Oh, no, we don't. We gotta look deeply into those eyes. Okay, oh, make a move. Invite to stay the night. I don't think that would happen. Move right in. That's, my girl Austin though, knows what she's doing. Oh, we can first kiss? Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, let me have her take a bath, though. Oh, I can't miss this. I can't. I can't. Ooh, I thought I was gonna miss it. Oh, that was so scary. You know, you already know I have to get my screenshot. Wow. Mess around an animal. You already know. Oh, not the phone. Stop it. And now let's do it. Mom is asleep. Perfect. Nobody has to know. It's like the uh, the uh, the song from Hamilton. Nobody needs to know. Period. Oh, let me get my screenshot. It always sucks whenever they're stanky because it ruins it. I'm trying to have the perfect screenshots and she's over here. Dusty and crusty. Oh. Well, there they go. Hi, people. Main goal for today, let's look at the spreadsheet so we can all be on the same page. But the main goal for today is to get to Asano's wedding. I, mean, I got us to 1569. So we went through about five, I believe it's five years of gameplay. But also, it would be great if we could get us to Mine aging up. Um, I don't think we'll definitely not get to Yura. I'm not even gonna try. So we're gonna start off with Izumi's birthday. She's aging into a teen, which is super exciting because that means she's gonna get married in what would that be? 1574. I'm hyped. I'm pumped. Okay, I'm just I'm freaking ready because that means the third gen is coming in full force in the 1570s and I'm ready. I think expanding this garden really helped, but we had a lot of uh, food for this season, which is so exciting. In fact, let me check our food storage. See, it's still over a hundred. Oh my god, I'm so excited or so happy. Oh no, Izumi's up. Well, now's the, the proper time to age her up while she's glitching through the floor. I already have my dice and all that prepared. Let me, can she like look up? There we go. But let's see what's going to happen to Miss Izumi. So let's look at her chances first. And the numbers she can't roll are a 7 and 17. So let's see what she gets. She, are you kidding me? I can't. I can't. I I cannot. No way. Bro, are you kidding me? That didn't even like. I saw the number and it didn't even register in my mind. Are you kidding me? Izumi can die. This is ruining our plans. Like I had entire plans for this entire character. And I can just pass them on a euro, but like still. So we're gonna kill her, but we're gonna plead for her to not die. And maybe it'll work. And then maybe she'll get married. <laughs> please work. I, I, please, but I beg of you. I don't know, it doesn't really matter. Fire. Okay. And we, let me, let me get this girl up. So that we can plead with her, with the, with the, whatever that man's called, Grim Reaper. Where's Grim? Is he gonna arrive? Like, what's happening? I wanna get the chance to save her. Plead, plead, come on, plead. Hurry up, stop crying. Come on, get on your hands and knees. 
Are you kidding me? No, 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 no. No, you plead. No, you plead. No. She's just dead. It's just over for her. What a shame. That's such a, a rare role. That like should never happen. I guess we'll just put her. Why can't we put her on the nightstand? Yeah, there we go. It's such a shame. Now it's just awesome. No, literally nobody's gonna be at the wedding. Barely anybody. I feel like it fits for her too because she's grown up in extreme poverty. She's had nothing her whole entire life. She meets a, this this boy and she falls in love. And she's like, this is my chance to escape and, and live my life the way I want to. If Yura doesn't die, because I did not think Izumi was going to die. I, I felt like she had too much plot armor. But obviously I was wrong. That, that just goes to show anything can happen. I wish I had put her in the cast and seen what she was going to look like. She probably would look like similar to them, but... Because Mine's jeans are very strong. Or maybe she would have looked more like Honda. I don't know. I don't know if I already said this, but something today I want to do is get all of... Uh, get Asuno proposed. Because um, we have a, about like nine months before the wedding. So we want to get her proposed ready to go. I don't know how far in advance people back then got proposed or uh, engaged or whatever. But that, I think we should go ahead and do that. I don't even know where we're going to get ma married. Like we would just get married here. Let me look up where they got married in the 1500s in Japan. Over the centuries, they started holding weddings at shrines, hotels, and ceremony halls. It says the wedding was traditionally held at night, but in the Edo period, it became customary to perform the ceremony during the day, especially in the case of uh, daimyo families. But that has something to do with us. Let me show you guys this thing I'm reading. Musical instruments, a tea ceremony, chess, tableware, kimonos, books, dolls, and so on. These might are these like gifts that they gave them? Still doesn't really tell me like where they got married. But we're just probably gonna do it at our estate. That'll probably just be the easiest thing because I don't think they had churches. Then it said they got married at shrines. So we could do that. Anyways, I think we should buy over Tomoji and go ahead and get them engaged. Okay, first we have to ask her to be his girlfriend. Where is he? She might be walking over to his house. Where are we going? Are he walking with his slow self? Like we haven't been waiting there for like an entire, like two hours, like come on. Let's talk to him about Izumi dying. Uh huh. Mm. Why he smiling? No one should have to experience watching someone they care about pass away. Mm. That's nice. And now he's sad. Okay, I think I might have to. Can I? Is there a way to make her happy? No, stop. I think I wish there was a way to get rid of this without getting rid of it, but I think we might have to. In order to get them engaged so i'll have i'll have her do the whole asking to be boyfriend thing <laughs> okay now he's happy so maybe now i can make him propose Okay, well, I, never mind. I guess she's gonna have to do it. <laughs> of course, it would not happen this way because women did not propose to men. But whoops. We'll, we'll just pretend. I don't even think they proposed in the first place. But it doesn't matter. That's it. I thought. I thought he jumps into her arms. Okay. But cool. Um, I guess that's it. Poor Mine. She's going through it. Poor baby. She just had it rough. Yesterday was rough. And now this man is possessing our trash can. Can't catch a break. Yeah, I'm already getting the notifications. Deji, you're about to die. Oh. Everybody's dying. I really want to check up on Yura, see how she's doing. She might be a little sad. So we want to go over there and check up on her. Maybe we should bring her some milk. Do we still have chocolate milk? Now we can head over to... 
their household. Oh, let's announce our engagement. Normal oots. A new relationship, all of that. Last time we were over here, I don't think I filmed this, but we were telling all the tea to to Yura. We were talking about how we didn't like our first kiss. All that. So I feel like she would tell her that. They're so cute. Oh, what's their sentiment? <laughs> Friends in a time of loss. Oh. That's perfect. I guess she's aware that <laughs> she died. Oh, we need to give her the stuff. See, they like never dislike it. Coyote hasn't been here. I don't know what she's out doing, but it's not taking care of her child. We have some more gifts that we need to give you. Barug. What did I just say? Oh, we got another sentiment. A jamtastic gift. How cute. So it seems like this loss of izumi has made them closer then we make the flower arrangement it's a chrysanthemum i was trying to figure out how to do this admiral's trap because i thought that might be good for fishing so we could catch stuff without like actually having to fish but i couldn't figure it out so if you know how that works then do that then i put a vase on our flower arrangement put it in our inventory it's ready for the wedding okay um, and then we're having a tea gals um, situation, made some pitch black tea. Um, then we're just sitting around the table, talking, catching up, trying to, you know, con con what is the word, console each other about the loss of Izumi. We're all very tore up about this. At this point, the, the tea gals club is literally just a family club, which I did not intend at all. I had Asuna, I think she was talking to Kaori about her love life, how she's engaged now. She wanted to, you know, let her know how she feels. I don't like Kaori, but I'm sure Asuna does. So she's close with her. She wants to tell her how things are going. I found a little wedding arch from Country. What's that pack called? You know what it's called. I don't, I don't remember. Country Living? Is that what it's called? I don't know. Fishing so that we can make roasted fish. I had Mine go pick out the green beans for our ro roasted fish meal for the wedding. Um, waiting for her to finish the meal. Uh huh, uh huh. Then we do it. There we go. Wedding. Press it. Boom. Then we invite our guest. I had to, you know, select through, through all those people in the entire game to find the peoples. As you do. I was going back and forth on whether I wanted um like if I wanted to just be family there but if it was just family there it would only be like a few people so we ended up inviting uh, some of the people around town whose family we know we don't really know them but it's a good opportunity to meet some new people so we invited Miho's family but she's dead so of course she won't be there okay let's go greet the groom I did invite Kaylin, but I think we'll just kick her out because I don't feel like giving her a makeover. There we go. And I need to be watching. Come on. I gotta get my pictures in. How oh, pretty. Why does he look so mad? Take the photo. Dang. Sick. Let's introduce ourselves to everyone. Oh, she doesn't even know him yet. Where's Yura? Oh, there she is. I want her to grill him. And we should also give um, Asuno her gift. Oh, what a sweet moment. Let's crank out the tea. Do some ginseng. Minnie's gonna be a good host and talk to everybody. Make sure everybody feels welcomed. 
This is kind of good because it gave us uh, an opportunity to introduce ourselves to people we didn't already know. Otomoshi and Yura are getting along. Maybe Violet and me, no, Asuna can be friends. I think we had a pretty successful wedding. But he already cleaning up. He's already getting into the mood. This is my house. That's what he said. I mean, they already went to bed. I guess we should end this then. We're gonna have them consummate the marriage. Cause I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready for the third gen. I'm a little excited, so I might check and spoil it for myself. But I won't spoil it for you guys. How about that? Okay. Well, let me check. Okay, I'm just gonna say it. she's not pregnant. I was I was trying to keep it secretive, but there there's really no point in that. So we'll just try again tomorrow. We're gonna end this episode, but right before we do, um, we're going to give. We're gonna roll for me and it is her birthday today and this is also the first day of 1570 so we are in a new decade very exciting okay so the numbers that she cannot roll are this is adult part two the numbers she cannot roll are one seven nine fifteen and seventeen lots of numbers um let me see what chance that is um, actually, I don't think I recorded the chance for adult part two, but it's it's pretty, it's a lot, it's a lot. There's a high likelihood that she might die. Um, let's see what she gets. I think she dies. She does. So we are starting with like practically a blank slate. She, at least she got to see her her daughter get married that's the great part about today is at least she got to see that let's do a cardiac explosion maybe that can be what she dies of we can try and plead for her again this never seems to work but we can try to do it come on he never does it. It never works. We lost two people. Now, we only have three sims again. It's alright, because the third generation is rolling in, hopefully. If you like this video, subscribe! It's free, just click the button, and while you're at it, click the, notif the notification button. Do it. Right now.